my lord. I didn't do anything. I just took a shower. I'm like, Joe, you didn't take a shower. How do you know I didn't take a shower? Joe, you were in there for 30 minutes and your hair is dry. y'all it's the Duma Shacks react and we're back with another video who we got today see today we're back with another Joe Coy reaction we're super excited to get into this video guys but if you're new to us and we're new to you uh -huh. make sure you scroll down hit that red subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell without further ado let's get into the video kids got it so good now so good Disciplining him is easier too though. I will say that. It is a lot easier to discipline my son. My mom had to be creative. But me, it's easy. If my son f***s up, and this is anyone that was a teenager. <laughs> they f*** up, what do you do? Take their phone away. That works. That works. You don't have to verbally abuse them. You don't have to physically touch them. Just take their phone away. <laughs> my son doesn't know what to do when I take his phone away. My son physically breaks down when I take his phone away. Hey, good. Oh, he's like, oh, dad. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what do I do now, Dad? Huh? No. <laughs> You've never seen his hand before. What is this? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> My mom, when she disciplined, she hit it. Mama like said, she never hit me, but goddamn, man. I remember one time I was hiding in the closet, she walked by and I scared her. <laughs> I jumped out. Bah! <laughs> oh, that's what no. You think that's funny? Jump out and stare at me like that, huh? Uh, Get back in that closet. Get back in the closet! Sit back in there, sit there. You sit there, guy, I tell you to come out. Sit there! That's funny, okay. That's that's a good that's one, Mom. Funny. That's good. Do what he did to you. Mm -hmm. And I sat in that closet. And then she forgot I was in that fing closet. She came back with laundry. Oh, what are you doing here? <laughs> Too funny. I've been here all day. <laughs> Crying. Uh, Snot it uh, up. Are you told me to here. You can apologize. Just go to your room. It's late now. Mm -mm -mm. Go to my room crying. She didn't give a shit. Mm. Called her sister, bragged about what she did. You're not going to believe what I did to Joseph. <laughs> Quiet. Oh, son, God damn it. He's 15. There's a thing about 15 year old boys, man. He thinks he's being slick and he's not. And I keep telling him that too. And that's the thing. If you got boys, if you got a little boy, just be honest with him. Talk to him like dudes. I can't speak for girls. I'm just saying. If you have a little teenage boy, talk to him like dudes. They'll respect you more. I don't hide it. I don't candy coat shit. I let my son know. I'm like, Joe, I know what you did in there. What are, you, what are you talking about, Jack? Well, I'm just saying, like, I was 15, oh. and I, I know what you did in there. Oh. Like, all the creepy shit you're doing, I did too. I was just better at it. <laughs> what are you talking about, Jack? Joe, come on, man. I know what you You were in the shower for 30 minutes, man. I know what you did. <laughs> oh, my Lord. I didn't do anything. I just took a shower. I'm like, Joe, you didn't take a shower. How do you know I didn't take a shower? Jack? Joe, you were in there for 30 minutes, and your hair is dry. to a big bottle of head and shoulders and it's empty. <laughs> and head and shoulders! <laughs> but your always smells like mint. It's just like <laughs> mint. mint and zinc come from here. Boy, boy, boy. It's head and shoulders, Joe, not in hand. That's that. <laughs> it's head and shoulders. No! It's oh like my lord. Hand, it's just head and shoulders. Boy, oh boy, that head and shoulder joke was a crazy one, huh? Was it? <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm, I, I understand my guy. I, I see what, what you mean. What you doing at 15? At 15? In a shower. In a shower, shower myself, definitely. Were you? Yeah, most likely. You wasn't using head and shoulders? Never had that. <laughs> oh my God. I stayed God. dirty. I was always outside. Like, I stayed in the shower. Oh, I always God. washed me. So <laughs> after that, I would eat and go straight to sleep and do it again tomorrow. Do. Okay. Yep. Right. Good times. 
<laughs> Let's just move on. All shall right, so we? man, yeah, this is funny. Like, I, I really feel him whenever he said that take the phone away from your child. You mm -hmm. don't have to mentally or physically abuse them. Like, just take the phone from them. They crash. They break down. Yeah. It's like when you give a child anything that they really adore, they love. Like, they just lose focus on anything. Strip it from. Them. Yeah. Take it from them and watch how they react. Yeah, definitely. But I feel like. You know, there's other ways. Oh, hundred percent. Other than traumatizing them, first of all, have them start from whenever you decide to give your child a screen, tablet, TV, whatever. Mm -hmm. Have a limit on it. Facts. By age, you know. So, um, yeah, that way they'll know after these hours are up. I don't get it. Mm -hmm. You know. So. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to speak on the other part, but I'm gonna speak on the tablet. Nah, I feel you though, man. Uh, she's so wild. <laughs> no, what's another way though? Let me see. What's another way that you guys feel? And I also want you guys to put that in the comment section down below because we do have a lot of parents mm -hmm. that watch our videos. Mm -hmm. So this can be very insightful. So what do yes. you feel that can be a very helpful tool to get your child in order without having to physically or mentally abuse them? All right. One way I feel is to maybe change their scenery First of all, we can always go with just talking. Mm -hmm. A good conversation. Because you got to think about it. If you're going to send your child away mm -hmm. to be, uh, you know, trained in a way that should go, the things that you would do at home, they're not going to do at that location. So if you right. was, you know, physically or mentally, verbally really tearing them down, they're not going to receive that at the new location they're going right, to get. They're going to get talked to. Yeah, they're going to get love. They're going to get love. Yeah, they're going to, they're going to be uh, sent to different locations where they can see different sceneries. Let them know you have options out here instead of focusing on this foolishness. Right. You know what I'm saying? So there's always other ways that you could do this. But again, I just think that you just got to stop, take a breather, be patient, mm -hmm. and then react. Because sometimes yeah. as parents, you know, a lot of us react first hand mm -hmm. fire then we start going crazy yeah we don't you don't stop we just i don't feel it. like first of all as i mentioned before it depends on the age of the child it depends Definitely. on the understanding of the child always mm -hmm. talk to the child and yeah start from talking and then there's remember that there are there are lessons in everything right so if your child did something that you didn't like don't just go straight you did this, blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. Help them understand what they did wrong. Help them understand ways that they can do better. And, yeah, just go from there. Because as a child, we see how vulnerable they are to the amount of, you know, um, what's the word I could say? The amount of enormous, as, as an adult, like, that don't make sense, enormous? Yeah, I'm trying to, what you saying? Like, as a child, we look at them and, you know, we already know they're vulnerable to anything that we say. Right. So, they, we notice They take certain, it harder. They take it so much more harder. You know what I'm saying? But you got to look at it as this. Because you said it could be also about the age limit. Now, if an adult do something like grab a glass and break it compared to a younger yeah. a child grabbing a glass and break it, you know... We may get easy tempered and say, hey, we told you to sleep without God. Damn, you're breaking something. But to the you adult, you'll be yourself. like, but the adult, you know what I'm saying? Even looking in the mirror, you break a glass and you'd be like, can me just pick it up? Right. Why not just have the same amount of love for yourself that you would have, you know, that you should have for the child? Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So just be like, hey, Definitely. just pick it up. Yeah. Be careful. Yeah. Don't make that same mistake again twice. Right. Or three times. Right. Or the fifth time. Okay, now I got to buy a whole new rack of dishes. <laughs> right. So, let's continue this conversation down in the comment section yes. below. We hope you all enjoyed this video. Give us some more requests to do. Subscribe, turn on the post notification bell. We'll see y'all soon. Peace.